Uh, Jerry Kelly, you may roll up your tent and join the Alliance Party. Your roadmap's going nowhere. Well, I don't think I'll be joining the Alliance Party anytime soon. Um, I mean, it was said during your conversation there that this is uh, a poll and not uh, a referendum. Um, Sinn Féin, the last time it was tried out scientifically, we put up front in our uh, approach that we are Republicans, that we want an Irish Republic, that that's where we intend to go, and people vote for us in uh, huge numbers. So if you want to be scientific, scientific about this, then go to the last election. Uh, Arlene has said, you know, bring it on. She said, you know, uh, Robinson has talked about, you know, turkeys at Christmas and all. Well then, let's have it. Let's, let's, let's bring the referendum, let's put that to the test, and I'm perfectly prepared to go out and argue that case because the argument during a referendum or during an election is an entirely different process to sitting here after we do a Mario poll or any yes, other uh, Yes, other an election is also different from a referendum. That's right. Mm. So, I mean, here's a little fact. 23% of Sinn Féin voters, or respondents rather than voters, of course, said uh, they would vote to, to stay in the United Kingdom. Well, I don't believe that. Mm. You don't think that perhaps because Sinn Féin has now become a party with wider appeal that you're also having people who aren't married to the very core, older traditional beliefs of a Republican well, what party? what we have tried to do and what we will continue to try and do is convince people that uh, a united land is the best place for them. And I believe it. And I'm a Republican. I believe it is the best uh, place for unionists and uh, Republicans and nationalists. That is an argument which we have a debate which we have started, is a debate which we will continue. But we are up if the referendum is tomorrow or in the next few years. We are up for that, that discussion and to put that uh, to the test. And, this, and, in the, and in the end, yeah. that is the final test. It is the referendum uh, of which is the final is. test as opposed to but, the But we have a couple of indicators. We have our poll and we have the Life Times, Life and Times survey, both of which show fairly similar figures, which shows that they're not, people are not crying out A for a poll. And if they are, going to go to a poll, a lot of them, an awful lot of them are going to say, let's stay where we are. And well, how many times have you sat before elections? In fact, it's, it's quite a consistent fact, if I could put it that way, that we sit before elections and they always underestimate uh, the Sinn Féin vote over the last number of elections going three years, and they've always got it wrong. So I don't have a faith in that you're putting in the, in the poll that we've uh, dealt with here. Uh, we're up for the challenge. The conversation has started. It is a huge challenge to convince uh, um, unionists or a section of unionists that a united land is the, is the place to go. But that's the discussion that we're having, and at least that discussion has been had by now. And we're up for the challenge that Peter Robinson and Dave Arlene, Arlene put. Uh, let's put it to the vote.